so we have a question over there question is position of coordinate of a particle that is confined to move along a straight line is given by x is equal to uh, 2t cube minus 24t plus 6 now where x is measured from the convenient origin and t is in second determine the distance traveled by the particle during the interval from t is equal to 1 to t is equal to 4 second so particle at 1 second is at where 2 multiplied 1 cube 24 times 1 plus 6 2 minus 24 plus 6 ok so we need to uh, subtract 24 and 8 ok this becomes 216 uh, we need to add, uh, subtract 24 minus 8 that is 16 okay so 16 minus 16 particle is at minus 16 meter at x is equal to 1 second at t is equal to 1 second and now particle at t is equal to 2 second where the particle is located at this time 2 cube minus 24 times 2 plus 6 so this become uh, 16 minus 48 plus 6 okay so now 16 plus 6 is equal to 22 and 22 minus 48 okay 48 minus 22 will be 26 so this is minus 26 meter now at x is equal at x t is equal to 3 particle is at 2 multiplied by 3 cube minus 24 times 3 plus 6 so it is at where so this becomes 27 3 cube that is 27 multiplied by 2 that is 54 and 54 plus 6 is equal to 60 okay and uh, 24 times 3 is equal to 72 okay this becomes 72 and this becomes 60 become minus 12 meter okay uh, and now x at t is equal to 4. So 2 multiplied by 4 cube minus 24 times 4 plus 6. So this becomes what? Six, 4 cube is 64 multiplied by 2 that is 128. 128 plus 6 becomes 134 minus uh, 24 times 4 is equal to how much? 96. So, what is 134 minus 96? 134 minus 96 is equal to 38 meter. Now, let's uh, make a straight line and uh, study the path. This is x equal to 0. t is equal to uh, not 0. Uh, at t is equal to 0, if I consider t is equal to 0, so particle will be at, uh, at t is equal to 0 particle is at 6 meter <coughs> but we'll consider uh, so this is not 0 I'm considering that this is x equal to 0 now at t is equal to 1 second first of all I am discussing this that x is equal to 6 meter at t is equal to 0 then at t is equal to 1 second particle is where minus 16 meter okay it is at minus 16 meter then at t is equal to 2 particle is at minus 26 t is equal to 2 particle is at minus 26 meter then t is equal to 3 minus 12 means particle now return from this position till here at t is equal to this is t is equal to 3 t is equal to 3 particle is at x is equal to minus 12 meter and then t is equal to 4, 38 meter. The particle's position at t is equal to 4 is somewhere here. 4 second. This is 38 meter. So that means, first of all, particle journey is like this. Uh, at t is, from t is equal to 1, we need to consider from this. So A, B, okay, then particle comes to C, then particle comes to D. From A to B to C, to d what is the distance covered from a to b it is uh, 
from 16 to 26 that is 10 meter plus from b to c now for for uh, traveling b to c it has to cover two paths first of all it has to return from b to a then from a to c b to a is 10 again plus a to c is how much 16 and 12 it is 4 then from c to d it is this uh, that this is 38 and this is how much from c this is 6 and this is uh, 12 12 from here okay and uh, 12 plus 38 okay so how much this is equal to 24 plus 12 is equal to 36 36 plus 38 74 meter this is the distance so correct answer is option number three hope this answered your question thank you very much